Now once you get the lead set in your saw, which the lead in your blade is the tilt of your blade as compared to the bed of your machine, you want one thirty second higher in the front. You can see here we've got a thirty second over three and three quarters. Right here we've got three and three quarters, so our lead is now set perfectly. Once you do that, then what you want to do is bring your guide up and just apply a little bit of tension up on the blade to where you know that your blade is setting firmly and straight on your guides. Just kind of snug them down and then you'll basically repeat the process in setting the lead. Here we have three and fifteen sixteenths. We have three and seven eighths, so we've got just a little too much up lead. Make any of your adjustments. You've got two adjustment bolts back here on the top, which pivot your blade, your guide up and down for your blade. What we're going to do is lower the front just a little bit. And we have one thirty second over three and seven eighths. And there we have three and seven eighths. So now our guide is set perfectly there. We'll lock the nuts down. Then we'll repeat we'll drop this guide down out of the way. Make sure it's not touching the blade. Then we'll repeat the process on the opposite side. Okay, and then once you've got the lead set on both sides of your machine, here we are good. Then you commence to setting the other side of your guide. Basically, just like the other side, apply just a little pressure to the blade to ensure that you're setting good on the blade with your guide. When you place your ruler on your blade, make sure that you set it between the teeth, that way the teeth are not pushing the blade up or down in any direction. have three and seven eighths. And we have a thirty second over three and seven eighths. So now our guides are set properly. As far as the tilt adjustment. And then after you drop it away, and okay, once you have your guide dropped out of the way, and then position your guide foot. What you want is about a sixteenth from the gullet of the blade. And we're roughly a sixteenth. And raise your guide up to where it just comes into contact with the blade. And as you'll notice there, you can hear the tapping sound. That tells me that my guide is just a little too low. solid now. Place your ruler. Flat all the way across so that ensures you don't have any up pressure on your blade. Once you've achieved that, then you set your guide roller. 
your guide roller, you want about half the distance that you have between the gully and the front face of your guide foot. Roughly a 30 second. If you set your guide roller, apply your foot back. Once you get your guide roller set, place your foot, tighten your nut up, a little pressure down, wiggle, no movement, ensure all the rest of your bolts are tight. Okay, once you've got your guides correctly set on both sides for your tilt, bring your L bracket forward. Take your guide foot, set on top. Ensure that you've got your guide up far enough. What you want to do is raise your guide up just to where it comes into contact with your blade but not applying any pressure. Once you get it where you want it, just kind of snug it down. You can tap the blade on either side. That'll ensure whether you've got any space underneath to check to see if you've got any pressure up on the blade. You can lay your ruler up on the blade like so. You'll notice there's no gaps from either side, so that ensures that the guide is not putting any pressure up on the blade. Once you've achieved that, then all you do is put your top guide foot back on. Make sure everything is good there. Finish tightening up your bolts on the back. Once you get all your bolts snugged up, just double check. Make sure it hasn't pulled. Take your guide roller, slide it up in. Rotate it around to the blade and then just back it off to where there's about a 30 second gap. And install your guide foot. Just apply a little finger pressure down on it to ensure that your foot is down on the blade. Then you can check and make sure that your blade has no play between the guides. Once you've got that, your guides are set.